Good morning, my dear students. Today we are going to learn lesson four, the boy and the bear. So, children, this is a very good story about the friendship. So now we are going to read out this story. So everyone listen carefully, okay? There was once a little boy who lived next door to a bear. They played together. Every day they rode their bicycles together, they flew kites together, they sometimes even stayed the night at each other's houses. So children, there was one boy who lived next door to a bear. So you can see here a little boy and a bear. They were best friend. Every day they played together and also they ride their bicycle, flew their kites together and even sometimes they stayed the night at each other's houses. The little bear told his mother, I have such fun there at the little boy's house. So children, the little bear said his mother that how they used to have fun together at the boy's house. The little boy talked about the bear's house morning, noon and night. At bear's house, he said, at bedtime we never sleep. And when his birth was ready, the little boy said, at bear's house we never sleep have to have a birth. So here the little boy talked about the beer house that in morning, noon and at the night he said that at beer house at bedtime they never sleep and also in the birth time, the little boy said that at beer house we never had a birth. So all these things they used to do together at the beer house in the morning, noon and at night, he said to his mother. I hope so children you have understood. So let's see in the next page. Well said his mother at last. Perhaps you could better go and live there at Bear's house and be a bear. She helped him pack his bag and open the door for him. After listening all this thing, his mother said that you could better go and live there at beer house and be a beer. And also she helped him to pack his bag and open the door for him to go at the beer house. But once the door closed, the little boy did not rush next door as he always did. He went very slowly down the path so when his mother closed the door once he did not rush very fast next door as he was doing always he went very slowly down the path halfway down he met the little bear hello the little boy said where are you going so, in the halfway, he met the little bear. The little boy said, Hello bear, where are you going? I am Des. I am going to your house to be a boy, said the little bear. Then the bear said, I am going to your house to be a boy. I hope so children, you have understood till here. So for today we will conclude here, tomorrow we will continue the remaining part of the story. So for today 
your homework will be this so here you can see some question are given who is your best friend write his or her name here so here you have to write your best friend name if she is female then write her name if he is male then write his name here okay where does your best friend live write his or her address here so you have to write here your best friend ad address where does she or he lived place name or village name you have to write here full address okay what games do you play with your best friend write the name of the games here so here you have to write the games name that you play with your best friend okay for an example like cricket football volleyball or any game that you play with your best friend mention here i hope so everyone had got it so not only in this book you have to write in your english homework copy so draw this picture exact how it is beautifully okay and write it so you can take two pages in this way you can take two pages and draw it bigger not small okay and decorate it nicely in this way how it is so you can add many more small small flowers to look beautiful and color it nicely and also write all this question and the answers of this question nicely with a beautiful handwriting i hope so everyone have understood so till then thank you